day two. Here we go. I'm Kier, and this is that vlog thing I'm doing. Yesterday I introduced myself a little bit and went into a small amount of what this uh, vlog experiment is all about. Uh, but I didn't uh, go into a whole lot of detail about uh, who I am, how I got to where I am, uh, all those normal things that come up when one person introduces themselves to another. So I think that's what I'll do today, is I'll give you the brief background of who I am and what I'm doing here, or how I got here. I'm from Bethel, New York, home of the Woodstock Festival of 1969, and not a whole heck of a lot else. Uh, growing up there wasn't the most exciting thing for me, uh, but I didn't have a whole lot in common with a lot of people around me. I was into horror movies and comic books and all sorts of other strange and unusual little things that, uh, back before the internet, you really couldn't find a lot of uh, information on unless you were in a bigger city. Being that I was more or less in the middle of nowhere, well, that wasn't happening very much and and I didn't have anyone to talk to about strange and unusual things like ghosts and UFOs and that great show Twin Peaks that was on. So when I finally graduated high school, uh, I took great pleasure in uh, running off to college up in upstate New York in Rochester. And uh, once I was there, I suddenly found so many people that I had a whole lot in common with. Uh, people who were outcasts in their high schools and middle schools, also people who had never really been able to find their place uh, until we were all together uh, in, in college. And we discovered the internet then. Uh, it's back in 1993. It was just starting to uh, really come into uh, what we all know it, because in 94, that's when we got the web. And the web kind of changed everything all over the place. Uh, when I graduated college, I realized I uh, didn't really have a plan. I, I had uh, spent a little too much time uh, hanging out with my friends, uh, having a good time. Also hadn't packed much at all before I graduated. I thought it would just be another couple of boxes. Turned out to be a whole nother carload of stuff. Planning. It's one of those iffy things sometimes. When I got my diploma, I um, realized, gee, I, I have to pack up my, my dorm room and uh, go somewhere. That took me back down to my hometown again, uh, where for uh, five more years I, I gained a new appreciation for my hometown. I got to see the beginnings of a performing arts center at the original Woodstock site. Got to learn a lot more about local history than I had ever heard before, uh, which gave me a much better appreciation uh, for for the the area I grew up in. I mean, I didn't still didn't really fit in in my hometown. Not uh, a lot of people, again, with common interests. Uh, my whole social life was an hour and a half away, at the absolute least. Um, so it was only a matter of time before it was time to uh, once again leave the uh, leave the nest. Uh, so I quit that job with uh, nothing lined up, no real plan, and uh, hit the road. Went down to uh, Georgia for Dragon Con in Atlanta that year, and uh, from there went down to Florida. Spent a couple months down in Florida with a couple of different friends. Uh, and then I headed north a little bit. And I came to the uh, D.C. area. I uh, stayed with some friends there uh, while I was driving around one day. Well, the car broke down. And I figured, well, if the car's happy enough here, uh, I'll stick around. So I've been in the D.C. area for uh, about a decade, a little over a decade now. And uh, technically, I'm still in the middle of my last big road trip. You know... Maybe I'll pick it back up again at some point. It's been a long and winding road. I don't know where it's leading. Um, not anymore. Once upon a time I did, but uh, a couple of turns in the road got in the way of that. In a nutshell, that's 
how I got here. There's a lot more stories involved in every little piece like that. Um, but those will give me things to talk about as we go on here. So thanks for coming back for day two. Uh, if there was something you liked here, hit the like button down at the, uh, down at the bottom, a little thumbs up. If uh, you want to follow all of these and be sure to hear every uh, new one of these that comes out, hit the subscribe button. Be sure to hit the gear and uh, hit the email notification. That way you'll know exactly when uh, one of these finishes. And if there's uh, other people you want to bring along for this ride, uh, share it. Let them know. Bring them in. Um, I'm Kier and I'll be back tomorrow. Hope you're here too.